It's a cold, blustery winter day in Colgate, and like most schools, the cheerleaders can be found walking in a pack. But for this group, it goes beyond cheer practice and common interest. Recently, they were invited to perform in the Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade in New York City and the New Year's Day Parade in London. When we're at cheer camp, they have to try out for All-American. When they make All-American, out of all the squads that are there, then they're invited to go to the London New Year's Day Parade. Jennifer Palmer is one of the girls who went on the London trip, and with a price tag of over $3,000, some serious fundraising had to be done. We sold Sonic cards, and we ran the concession stands for softball, did an Indian taco sale, we sold Little Caesars pizza. We did a lot. For Jay Lee Riley, who went to both New York and London, the work was well worth it. It didn't hit me until like I was on the plane. I was looking out the window. I was like, oh my gosh, I'm going to New York. I'm going to London. Like, this is real. This, all that hard work like paid off. That sentiment was shared between all three girls. Before we actually went to New York, I really didn't believe I was going. So when I got there, it was like, it was amazing. It was just a lot different coming from a small town and going to a big city. It's really cool just looking around and th and like realizing like you're in the Macy's Day Parade and that you're going to be on TV. It's, it's really crazy and just everybody like waving at you and smiling and there's a whole bunch of people there. It's just a really cool experience. It's such a big difference from here like everyone's so country and like it's just so different, like they don't have that over there. Like I saw the day of the parade, we saw guys in cowboy boots and cowboy hats and mullets and I was like, wow. Seeing that in the middle of that big city makes me realize like how different it is from here to London, England. After returning to Oklahoma as quasi-celebrities, the girls have kept their egos in check. Jay Lee and Morgan both help with an after-school program at the elementary school. They are our aides for our teachers in the classroom and we, they do a great job and it gives them experience and it gives them the opportunity to work with the children and the children react really well to the, to the high school girls. It's really nice. I, I love working with kids and stuff. It's like got me to um, know what I actually want to go to college for, which is like education, like early care and stuff. With compassionate student leaders like this, we know that the future is in good hands.